the plan is take off, climb up to 1,000 feet. Okay. Once you're through 1,000 feet, we're going to turn left just 45 degrees. Okay. So to a heading of uh, 215. Okay. We'll continue climbing to 1,500. Once we can verify we're on the east side or south side of the airport, Gordonsville Airport, we'll turn the runway heading. We'll follow it down until we get to the white blockhouse building, the distribution center. Then we'll turn left 45 degrees, go out a minute. We'll do. We'll turn on runway heading, make a make a parallel uh, gram box, and then we'll reverse and come back in for 45 entry into the uh, left downwind for two three. Okay, sounds good. All right, so go ahead and do your lineup and everything. Yep. So it's heading Power up. correct. All right, looks good. Looks good. Okay. Speeds alive. All righty. Good. Okay, you're through 600 feet, so relax your back pressure just a little bit. Let the airspeed come just above 80. Trim for just above 80 if you need to. And then follow your bug up until we get through 1,000 feet. Call crosswind departure from the pattern. Okay. Orange County traffic, Cessna 7912 uniform. Crosswind runway 26 for departure from the pattern. Orange County. Okay. And then turn to 215. Turn. Keep climbing. Turn to 215. Once you get to 1,500 feet, level out, stay on this heading. Okay, level out. And power about 2,300. Good. Okay. About one o'clock, uh, behind some trees, you can see that big white blockhouse building. Yes. Okay. All right. Keep coming out a little further. More towards and, the south. And, yeah. Turn. Okay. Yeah. You're on good, good course. Okay. In the distance, to the right of the water tower, you can see Gordonsville, the town, the village. At the water tower. Yes. Just, okay. I then see to it. the right of that is Gordonsville. Okay, now what we want to do, now that we're past the uh, open green areas here, turn right to the runway heading. So turn to 230. Apply 230 and move your orange bug to 230. Good, all right. Once we get to where that white blockhouse building down here comes here in your window and starts going toward this vertical part of the air the airframe here then go ahead and turn left 45 degrees 
Yeah. You said from 230? Yeah. I think one. Yeah, so yeah, 185. Okay. So we'll fly this heading 23 until we make our left turn. Airport's down there at about 1 o'clock. What we're doing is going out and coming back in on a 45 angle to get in the left downwind for runway 23. Good. Okay. When that building gets to here, go ahead and turn left to 185. Stay at your altitude. Once you're established on the course heading 185, go ahead and use the second hand, if I can get it going again, on your clock to time a minute out. Once you've gone a minute out, turn right to the runway heading 230. Shannon 701, left right. downwind, runway 24, Shannon. Bring your power up about 50, so it's in the bottom of the green arc. We don't want to have any carb icing. That's good. That's better. Yep. But that's a good, that's good right there. Okay. You timing us a minute? Yes. Okay. more seconds and that's a minute. Alrighty, go ahead and turn to 230, which will be the bug. Okay. So what we're looking for is the airport and the VDOT complex with that um, kind of like uh, Quonset hut hangar is yes. for them to come to the right to the rear right Sound corner of, of the wing, we are five miles south of and then we're going to turn the part of the area upon the traffic. Right hand turn about 135 degrees and aim at the V dot hangar. Okay, a little further. Okay, start your right turn. So we're going to come around and aim the nose of the aircraft at that V dot open Quonset hut hangar. Shannon 701 left base runway 24 Shannon. Okay, switch your bottom radio. Switch your top radio. Bring in COM2. Okay, keep coming around and aim at that Quonset hut hangar to the left of the airport. Airport. Automated weather observation. One, six, zero, seven, Zulu weather. Wind, three, six, zero, at four. Visibility, one, zero, clear, below. We're going to have to use runway five. Okay, turn right. Two, two, zero, five, zero. Two, niner, eight, two, remark. Density altitude, 2,200. Just stay at altitude. We're going to go across the departure end of 05, and then we're going to use the 05 downwind near the ridgeline. Automated weather observation. 1608 Zulu weather. Wind 340 at. 1.5. All right. Once we get down past the end of the runway here, we're going to turn left to a heading of 320. We're going to cross the departure end of uh, 05. Okay. Bring your power up just a smidgen to stay in a green arc. That's good. That's fine. Alright, go ahead and start a turn to 320. 
Orange traffic says a 7912 uniform. Crosswind transition to left downwind for 05. We're crossing the departure end of 05 at 1,500 feet. Orange, uh, Gordonsville. Okay, hold your heading. Go toward the ridge line. Relax your back pressure a little bit. Come down just a little. Once you get past the runway, we're going to do a left hand turn to the war. Got and parallel the runway. Oh, okay. And we're going to stay on the other side of Highway 15, between 15 and the ridge line. I think this is the clearest day yet. Been out here because I don't think I've seen past yeah. the ridge line yet. Okay. All right. Start a slow turn to the left. See that power line cut with the power line in it? Yes. I want you to follow that power line cut. Easy. Don't over back. Gordonsville, 7912 uniform, left down, wind 05. Okay, pre landing checks are? All right, so both. fuel's on both. Rich. Make sure full rich. Okay. All right, just kind of hold this heading for now. All right, once we get to where that red T hanger goes behind the strut, turn your car beat on. Good. So okay, once on. we get to the five where it, it's behind the strut, reduce your power to 1700. No traffic, stock for some dinner and on a five mile final on FMA five. Okay. Slow your aircraft. You're not in white arc. Stay to the right. You gotta stay wide a little bit. Okay. Flaps Flaps ten and twenty. White. Ten. Twenty. Okay. Okay. Pitch for eighty. Okay, now that we get around over to the edge of town here, start your left-hand base. Call base for 05. Gordonsville traffic, Cessna 7912 uniform, turning base, runway 5, Gordonsville. Too slow. Stay at 80. And just do a U-turn. Descending U-turn to the left. Final on Call your final. Gordons County traffic, Cessna 7912 uniform, turning final, runway 5, Gordonsville. Okay. All right. Bring her around and line her up. Power settings, good. Okay, flaps 30. Reduce your power to 1,400. If you look on the right-hand side, you've got your alignment of element panels, which are discussed in the AIM, and the center panel is back point from the traffic, front two. Okay, bring your power down another 100. Bring your power down another 100. Idle your power. Come in, transition your eyes to the other end. Back pressure to level, just back pressure. Okay. Good. Okay. Not, not, don't overdo it on the brakes. Just pull back all the way and braking. Straight ahead braking. Yeah, all right. Turn off. Come around, we'll clean up. There is a technique that you will learn after you solo for short field landings to do that more efficiently. Okay. But that's just a regular landing on this runway. Okay. 